Yo, guys, we got ourselves some Shining Fates. I'm going to be opening up this Dedenne Shining Fates Mad Party pin collection and this Eldegoss Shining Fates V10 thing. It's going to be a really good time. Huge shout out to Full Grip Games for sending me these two products for free, dude. For free. Absolutely zero charge. Uh, can't say that that will be the same uh, with you, but they do have a quite the selection of products that you can buy from their store. So I would suggest you do that. Go on over to fullgripgames.com for more products like these two bad boys and many, many more. They also do singles. They do codes, fullgripcodes.com. Super great site that gets you codes delivered instantly. So I would recommend that as well. I know this isn't what we normally do on this channel, but... Don't click off. I think this will be really fun. I think you're going to want to see some of these cards uh, in person because I know that these are really hard to get a hold of. So if you're somebody that likes the channel for our in-game PTCGO content, um, you know, keep watching or leave a like down below, leave a comment, you know, help drive this to other people that maybe like to see openings. And if you guys like this enough, maybe we'll do a few more in the future. So this is our Shining Fates opening video. I keep waggling these around like they're, I don't know, tennis rackets or something but anyway let's get on into it let's have a little bit of fun all right a little bit of a different video here for you guys but we're going to be opening up one of the shining fates mad party collections and one of these eldegoss tins these are beautiful cards on the outset here i especially love listed denny cards so let's get into it not something we normally do on the channel but uh, I'm excited to uh, to bring some new content. And hey, if you guys like this, please make sure to drop a like down below. Uh, we might do this more in the future. Uh, so we are here in the living room. Say hi to the Creewall living room as I aesthetically open for your ASMR pleasure this box. Oh, slides right out. And what I love about this, and you'll see this on a lot on the older promos, is that they have, like, they'll have, um, the promo will be, stuck inside and and like fastened with little things but these ones it's it's just covering so this is like a very clean promo you can look at the card like the only real dings here on the corners but like they have to you know they have to do something right you guys can see that there so anyway it's a great the Dene looking nice there gonna be a very, very popular way to play Mad Party in the future with all these shiny cards. Look at that. It's just, it's, it's a beautiful card, man. It's a beautiful card. We got the pin as well. Nice little Dedenne pin, my favorite. I love the rat. And uh, four shining, three shining fates. Four shining fates. Three shining fates. And that pin collection there as well. Y'all can take that code. Don't say I'm not benevolent. <laughs> All right, so here is our shiny face first pack. Dude, this one feels like a good one. I, it has been so long since we've opened packs on this channel. Two, three, four. Is it four? I think it's four. Ah, that's our rare. <laughs> it's three. <laughs> so Celebi, Ball Guy, Floatzel. More Pekka, Buizel, Nicket, Cacnea, Qfont, the cutest elephant in the game, and a reverse hollow Dreadnaw. All right, a little bit of a stinker there with our first one. Wow, these packs feel different. I don't know if they feel like more plasticky or like papery or something. I don't, they just feel different than normal packs. So that's interesting. Um, they feel like they have like a weird like gloss to them or something. I don't really know what to make of it, but here we go. Three to the front. We got a Rotom, Flotzel, Tropius, Glass of Fluor, Choodle, more Peko again, Cacnea again, Horsey and oh my goodness, Reverse Hollow Ball Guy, and Erp. A dread. Oh my god. Oh, there's one more behind it. Oh, I'm psychic. What did we do? Wait, we put three to the front and then it was that? I need to make sure we get our 
pack opening skills figured out here for this last pack of the pin collection. Is it? It's it's three, right? It's three to the front. That's what we did. Three to the front. Rotom, Crammy, Rusted Shield, Morpico, different art though. Choodle, same art. Evie, Horsey. Another Kakia. Get out of here, buddy. Oh, yo, the first shiny. And a Manaphy. Look at that. Shiny Phalanx. Nice looking card there. You can see all of that pattern and that shine on the card. Unbelievable textures that you're seeing there. My goodness. These are just beautiful products. Okay, so we got our first hit of the night, the Phalanx. And, uh, yeah, nice looking card on the back, too. Very good. There it is, Phalanx. Take a look at that. Little edge whitening there at the top. But great looking card. Okay. Move that all off to the side, and now is the big boy. The Eldegoss boy. I wanted to get Eldegoss. They gave me a choice. Full Grip was super nice. They were like, hey, do you want to have... Eldegoss, Boltund, or Cramorant. And I was, it was really, like, I was debating really hard between all of them, because I love Cramorant Shiny. Uh, the Boltund, you know, I got third place, or 13th, excuse me, third, <laughs> 13th place in uh, PC3 with Boltund Picaram. But Eldegoss, I was like, you know what, this is probably the most versatile. It's played in pretty much every single deck right now. So let's go ahead and up as well. I'm going to keep this code card for me. This one's for daddy. So you don't get to see that, but wow. Wow. Holding these cards, amazing. I don't really do a lot of pack openings. So to hold all these shiny cards, like I didn't do anything for Hidden Fates. This, I mean, this looks amazing. Just, just the hollow and stuff. Like, oh my gosh. Look at that texture. Unreal stuff. All right, so let's put that in a sleeve. And we'll get it rolling. Okay. So, some Shining Fates. We got how many here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Shining Fates booster box. Or booster pack, excuse me. So I'm going to save the Charizards for last, because we know that those have Charizards in them. That's the, that's the rule for all Charizard... Booster packs, they must contain a Charizard. Oh, let's see if we can get this thing open here. Yeah, these ones, I feel like they're harder to open than other packs. I don't know, maybe that's just me, my weak, my weak uh, bassoon fingers, but I feel like they're actually harder to open. All right, so it's three, right? It's three? Because we did four, and that didn't work. All right. Luxio, Team Yeltao, but these are the uncommons. Hmm. I'll get it figured out eventually. Thwacky, Horsey, The Grook, The Peck, Spinarak, Boezel, Reshiram, Amazing Rare Dude! <laughs> Yan Mega and something else. Who cares though, bro? Oh my gosh, the coolest thing? I didn't even realize. Look at this card. The texture extends all the way to like the retreat cost. Oh my god. So like this, I felt it first. They have the texture on the um, the weakness resistance retreat, on the amazing rare symbol, and on the energy cost. Like it is awesome. Look at that. That's so good. Oh my gosh. Let me get a little sleep for that guy. Wow, what a hit. That is huge. And once again, let's take a look at the back. There we go. You can see pretty clean stuff. It is one of my goals to collect all these amazing rares. I don't know if it's actually going to happen, but these are just absolutely gorgeous cards. Love that for us. Let's go ahead and open another one. Already, for, uh, for free product. Can't do much better. All right, let's get to it. 
Let's try four this time. That might be the trick. So there's the Psychic, Luxio, the Wacky, Ball Guy, Shinx, Horsey, Yanma, or Paco again, dude. Coughing. Yo. Yo! <laughs> oh, unbelievable. Look at that, two in a row. This is a great shiny, indeedy. Looking cute, buddy. Let's get you in a sleeve. Wow, two packs from this tin, two hits. Gotta love it. What a card. Unbelievable. This looks so good. All right, next pack. Oh, this one's going to be good. I, I, it's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. All right, four to the front. Metal for luck. Dartrix. Ball guy. Crammy. Rowlet. Choodle. Morpico. Coughing. Gossifleur. Shinx. And, oh, another hit. What is it? <laughs> little miscut you can see it there at the top the bottom is definitely way thicker but oh my look at that that is a great supporter wow this is a beautiful card dude this is so good looking oh my goodness i'm so hype about this card that is stellar let's get that into a sleeve as well Sleeved up here. Looking good, buddy. All right. Pack number five from our tin. I told you that was a good one. I told you it was heavy, man. I I definitely I definitely said it was heavy. So water. Jim Trainer. Floatzel. Rusted Sword. Nice competitive card for us. Rowlet, somebody should make a uh, paint by number out of this. I keep saying that, but somebody actually do it. Snom, Grook, Spinarak, Barascuda is the shiny, and we got a boss's orders as well. So nice little Barascuda there. You can see it with that spiral jet attack doing 130 for two. A little conditional, but not too bad. All right. Oh, yeah. I, I like, actually, this does feel really heavy. <laughs> yeah. oh, you're like, JW, stop it with the jokes. I'm like, I can't. I'm literally only capable of making, like, two jokes at a time. All right, fire for luck, because this, uh, this pack has our Charizard. A Rusted Sward. Rotom. Rowlet. Q-Font. Spinarak. Stomp. Horsey, Boweasel, Frostmoth is the rare there. Nice looking card as well, but no Charizard, unfortunately. We're down to our last pack. Last pack, Monty. Here we go. Four to the front. Dark Energy. Rotom. Rusted Sword. That's our third, I think. It's pretty nice. Weasel. Shinx. Trap Inch. Coughing. The Reverse is an Indeedee. And that is our rare Adrednaw. So let's take a look at the hits that we had. Wow. In, uh, what, nine packs or something? Got some pretty decent stuff here. The Bear Scooter, that, uh, that shiny. We got the Indeedee as well. That uh, nice V Pokemon. We got a Piers. Great looking full art here. Of course, it came with the Eldegoss from the tin in the front. And then probably the best pull of the day, that Reshiram Amazing Rare. Quite the card. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I'll catch you on the next, uh, next video. But until then, remember, good luck and also have fun.